gang. On with the Kunlun. Wait, am I saying that right? Up into the snowy mountains, huh? <laughs> and I left my big coat at home. Don't worry. I'm sure Miss Marvel here can stretch into a nice big scarf if you get too cold. Uh, don't I get a say in this? Who dares approach the cave of the dragon? Just a group of friendly neighborhood heroes out collecting dangerous glowing artifacts. Is your mom home? Only those versed in the way of the Iron Fist can enter this cave. I sense that none among you possess this power, but there is one in the monochrome city who may. The monochrome city? Sorry, I don't think that's quite vague enough for me. Guess that's all the information we're getting. I think I know where he's talking about, though. Let's go check it out. Seems to be the place. Eyes peeled for anyone who knows the Iron Fist. Huh? Who have we got here? Well, if it isn't the Iron Fist himself. That makes sense. Hey, can we borrow you for something real quick? Sorry, but I got something I need to take care of here first. Kingpin's gained control of this area, and we need to sneak into Fist Tower and take him down. Daredevil and Luke Cage have nearly finished their preparations. If you can give them a hand, maybe we can take care of this business tonight. After that, the Iron Fist is all yours. Sure, that could work. You scratch my back, I help you take down a criminal mastermind, right? Thanks. I'm sure my other two friends will be glad for the help. Just let them know when you're ready. Hey, I heard you've been roped into helping us. Let me fill you in on the detail. So, the plan is for a group of us to sneak our way into the building inside a big shipping crate. Figuring out how the crate actually gets inside is Luke's job. What we need to figure out is what our fake delivery is pretending to be. The last thing we want is some nosy security guard peeking into our crate, so we need a convincing cover story. I've heard that Kingpin is expecting a delivery of something, but that's all I've got. I need you to gather some more information from his associates on exactly what's in that delivery. The... Great. A bunch of Kingpin's loose-lipped employees hang around this area. See what you can find out from them. I ain't no creeping into my apartment. And I live on the other side of town. Say what you want about the working conditions of Fisk Industries. The bathrooms are immaculate. <laughs> They're nicer than my apartment. A lot of dodgy dealings going down on the dark side. <laughs> this is your glorious leader, Kang the Conqueror, reminding all citizens that Friday is Kang Day. Happy Kang Day, everyone. What? <laughs> What do you mean, it's not Friday? <laughs> In other news, all other days are now also Kang Day. Happy Kang Day. I'm gonna last at this job. Kingpin fired his last assistant for using blue top milk instead of red top in his coffee. The poor doll couldn't tell them apart.
I heard the guys at the docks fished a whole bunch of diamond-tipped canes out of the sea the other day. No idea how they got there, but I wish I could have bagged one before they took them all away. Business. Coffee and tea sales through the roof. You hear about Fred and the delivery he was taking to Fisk Tower? Oh, he forgot to secure the crates to the truck. One sharp turn by the docks and cut sploosh. Whole shipment goes in the water. No idea what was in there, but <laughs> Kingpin's gonna be waiting a while for it to arrive. Nobody told me a monorail system was going to appear overnight. Guess this train car we dug up ain't much good for anything now. Best we can do is strip it for parts. Well, heard the latest off the rumor mill? The fellas in the copy room say Kingpin has a special wax to keep his head shiny. <laughs> Gotta take that with a grain of salt, though. The same guys told me color TVs were a thing. Did you find any information about that delivery? Sorry to put this on you guys, but you know how it is. So, what did you find out? Yeah, this is good. Okay, that could be relevant. So a bunch of diamond canes never made it to Fisk Tower. That means he should still be expecting it, which gives us the perfect story for our delivery. Nice work. Now we just need to hope everyone can fit inside that crate. There's a few more of us than in the original plan. Think you can help Luke out with his thing? I'm sure he'd appreciate it. You're gonna help us out, huh? I got just the job for you. Appreciate the help. Security in this place is tight, so our only option is to head in through the front door. With the right disguise, one of us should be able to just stroll right in past the front desk, while the others, well, that's Daredevil's part of the plan. What I need you to do is bring me that disguise. You got facilities in the Avengers Mansion for just that sort of thing, right? I'll show you what we need. If you can bring it to me, we should be cooking with gas. What'd you say? Awesome. Here's what we need. I don't mind if you're wearing it. Probably easiest that way.
to see you back so soon. Huh? You need a costume? Okay, I'm not even gonna ask. <laughs> Go for that stuff, right? Other end of the room, door on the left, just below where you came in. All systems engage. Okay, let's show. Appreciate the help. Security in this place is tight. So our only option, what I need you to do... Perfect. This should allow us to sneak in without anyone batting an eye. Yeah. No one ever suspects the delivery boy or girl. We don't know who's wearing it yet. Guess we'll flip a coin later. Anyway, thanks for the help. Thanks, guys. Now everything's set, we can spring our plan whenever you're ready. Let me know when you're good to go. So, with the help of the superior eyes of Heimdall, the heroes now know where all the pieces of the Nexus are. They just need to get them to Doctor Strange so he can work his magic, and nowhere can be brought to Chronopolis. One of the fragments is somewhere in Kunlun, the mystic and strange land where it's all meditation and yak's milk and iron fist. Iron fist? I remember that guy! He'll help the heroes get into Kunlun and get their fragment. If they can help him take out Kingpin who set himself up in the New York of the Roaring Twenties. Okay, so who's helping Fisty? Spider-Man? You gotta be kidding me! We had to take down Kingpin. And one man stood in the way. Um, delivery for Mr. Kingpin. What is it you got there? Walking canes. Crystal tipped. Hey, take the elevator. Fifth floor. Through the office. What kind of doll are you? The kind of doll that don't appreciate guys calling her doll. Huh. You better not be calling me doll, either. I'd arranged a rendezvous with a guy who could help on the inside. So you're Spider-Man's contact? Are you guys related? Let's just say we have a few things in common. Taking down the notorious Kingpin, huh? Sounds like quite a caper. Count me in. Thanks, Turtleneck. I'm glad I looked you up. Careful, team. Fisk and his goon squad will be looking for us. Huh? 
What was that? That door. Did it just slam on its own? Are those electric locks? Seems just a little high tech for an office block in this era, don't you think? With Kang in charge, anything's possible. Let's find a way to open it. Beginning will help deal with this. I'll deal with this. takes him down but me. Uh, was that you, Miss Marvel? Oh, yeah. Because that totally sounded like me. <laughs> Didn't sound... Yay! Problem solved. <laughs> Good work. Let's keep moving. Training in Kun Lun didn't prepare me for this.
Listen up, you no good punks. I told you to leave this to the professionals. This is your last warning. I don't know who it is, but the cheaper the crook, the gaudier the pattern, huh? Well said, Spider Bogey. Huh? <laughs> You losers to stay out of my business. Now you're gonna pay. Hammerhead. Should have known he'd feel right at home here. This place, the Kingpin's territory, it's all gonna belong to me. I won't let you get in my way. Huh. Another power hungry villain that wants to be top of the world? This is personal, between me and Fist. You seem quite angry, Mr. Hammerhead. Have you ever tried yoga, meditation? Perhaps some herbal tea will calm your burdened soul. into that unbreakable head of yours. We should all be working against Cat and not fighting each other. Did something just bring me to life? trying to stop me. I'm doing you a favor. No thanks. We'll handle the villainous gangster dethroning around here. friends. Kang suggested I might want to enter the race for mayor of this town. I won, of course. Nice suit, Matt. You know this dame? I don't recognize her voice. Another timeline twist, guys. I'm so glad you could make it to my little victory celebration. As you can tell, my future is very bright. Man, those are some strong headlights. There's got to be a way to get past. Time to get to work. Do you like my new car? It's a little present from our glorious new leader. 
Glorious. What happened to you, Fisk? The Kingpin I know doesn't share power. Ha! In good time, Daredevil. After all, you must first get behind someone before you can stab them in the back. I'll deal with Kang eventually, but you first. in the name, Fisk. Ha! Take your shot. Now that I'm the mayor, you heroes will soon be no more. But you only won because Kang programmed his robots to vote for you, right? Well, I... Gah! Attack them! Attack! I get myself in these crazy situations. Gee, thanks, true believers. Egg don't be on. for the stuff dreams are made of. I'll get you for that. Bad things happen to people that try to embarrass me. It's my favorite song. Just wait until this song is finished. I'll show you some manners. Hang on. Just wait there. I'm warning you. Your reign as mayor is over, Kingpin. Get Kang on the phone! He promised me protection! <sighs> I think we've all spent too long here. Well, how do you think I feel? Come on, guys! Live a little! Mm. <laughs>
Excelsior! <laughs>